G'day internet, this is Cat Tiger here again and welcome to this episode of VoiceOver Point of View. So I have an iTunes card here today, got over Christmas, woohoo, and I'm going to show you guys how to put an iTunes card into your account with outsider assistance using your device's camera. It is quite simple. Okay, so let's get into this. So I'm aware that most of my subscribers are probably low vision. So I'm going to do my best to explain for them, assuming that you cannot see it. Um, so if you can, that's great. And I thank you for your patience. So I have the iTunes card here. It's still in its packaging um, with that the cardboard stuck to the back of it uh, when you pull it off a shelf. So first I'm just going to pull that cardboard off. Okay, so this iTunes card does not have the glue that um, you can use to orientate where the sticker is. Um, but you can feel the sticker up the top and that's where the code is you pick that away uh, and for those of you who might have a bit of vision there is a black bar down the bottom just under the barcode that you can use to orientate as well that is at the bottom so therefore you know that the thing is at the top but what I'm going to do, just to make double sure, is I'm going to select a corner here, the bottom right corner, and I'm going to just crimp it up a little bit so I can feel it. Okay, so now I'm going to pull off the little silver sticker. Pick that off. So I'm going to pause this now, and I'm going to get my iOS device. I'll be right back and welcome back well unfortunately i've had a recording issue my phone stopped recording at some point in my redeeming video after i came back with my ipad and i essentially was talking to myself and i used the code and then when i went to sign off i found that it had stopped recording so i'm going to record this again and I'm going to continue as if the code is still valid. However, at the end, I will get a different message to what you would get. But we will get to that when we get to that. So, I get my iPad. Now, the easiest way of redeeming a iTunes card that I've found is by going into the Apple iOS iTunes store you can do it through the app store however I find that the iTunes store is less cluttered um, down the bottom with links and things and it's a lot faster to find that redeem button Apple store folder. Free apps. so I'm gonna go Apple store to folder. Apple store. iTunes, store. iTunes selected iTunes music tab one of seven and I'm gonna scroll all the way down the bottom Sing page two of three page three of three now I'm going to go to TV tab, TV shows, tab movies, just down the bottom tab, to TV orientate. Shows, tab, now I'm going to move seven. my finger up until I hear either terms Button. and conditions. Okay, so I found terms and conditions. Conditions. Now I'm going to go swipe back send and I will get Button. send gift. And then next to that, swipe back one more and we'll, we will get redeemed. Redeem. Um, if you were going the other way, you would hear um, your Apple ID. And then redeem, and then send gift, and then terms and conditions. But I find going from the bottom is faster. So I'm going to click redeem. Redeem. Cancel. Button. Cancel. Button. Now another pop-up box has um, come up. So all that's selected now is cancel. But I'm going to swipe forward. You'll have to swipe forward to find out what it says. Redeem. Dimmed. Button. Redeem your gift card using your iPad's camera. Redeem your gift card using your iPad's camera. That's what we want. This requires a gift card with a box around the code, as shown here. And we want to select use camera. Use camera. Button. That's a button. Let's click that. You scan card. Camera viewfinder. Now Place this camera, interface. The card. Then slowly pull the device back. Let's start from the top left cancel. corner. Button. Let's cancel. 
Then swipe forward one. Scan card. We've heading. just basically got a heading. It has no function except for a heading. Camera flip. Now okay. we have camera flip. And the rest of the screen is pretty much the display. Now, unfortunately with this camera flip button, there is no way of telling what camera it is using right now. However, I'm pretty sure it defaults to the front facing camera. Because every time I've done this, it's been on the front facing camera and I use the back facing. So if it was going to save that, um, it probably would have. So I'm going to press switch ca camera flip, camera okay. flip. Camera switch flip. it to the back camera. However, it would be good if we did have some sort of indication of what camera it is for people who totally couldn't tell that at all. So the next step we go is we position our card. Now, if you cannot see where your camera is, you will have to feel for it. And um, that, my camera, the back facing camera, is in the top right corner pretty much of my device. And my front facing, just for information, is pretty much smack bang in the middle of my device. About one centimetre from the top of the device down just above my screen but I'm using the back facing so we position our card then we find our device's camera position now when we put the left device hand. pretty much Home button to the left. Scan card. on top camera of camera. the card back facing camera on the center of the credit card then and it's scattering away hand. now all I'm going to do now is I'm going to lift my iPad slowly off the bench and it should read the code. You may get asked to log in to your iTunes account as an alert to put the card in around this point. I didn't because I have just logged in before and I got an error message saying this code has already been redeemed. This code has already been redeemed. Of course it has. Error. However, if that was you guys, you probably would have been asked to log into your account, whatever method you use, either your touch ID or your password, whatever, and then it should say um, something along the lines of your account, you have successfully redeemed this code, your account has been credited with X amount of money, whatever the card was. Um, do you want to redeem another code? Um, and I think there's a done button as well. Um, unless it's an Apple Music subscription and then um, I believe the message is a bit different. Uh, something along the lines of your subscription is good up until some date and then your you will start paying your subscription unless you turn it off in some settings or something along those lines. I will do another video for Apple Music subscriptions if there's any interest down the track. But anyway, it is those steps prior is pretty much exactly the same. In fact, they are the same. Just the end message is a bit different. So I hope this helped you guys. And... Um, yeah, I hope it was of some benefit. If you do know someone who this video could benefit, please feel free to send them my way. And um, as always, guys, um, thanks for watching. And take care and happy shopping. I'll see you guys next time. Peace. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. See you next time. Smiley emoji.